Increase at the pump, more money to drive on the turnpike, and more time on Sundays to buy alcohol. A new year is bringing a new set of laws for Pennsylvania. And some of them could cost you money if you don't follow them. Money editor John Delano takes a look at what's new for 2017. The first of every year always means a tax hike in something, and 2017 is no different. Starting with something most of us feel at the gas pump. I think that's horrible. It's ridiculous. And how about starting this year with those gasoline prices? It wasn't that long ago when we were paying two bucks a gallon. But look at it now, 265. And much of that is a higher gasoline tax. Overnight, the state gasoline tax jumped eight cents a gallon after a nine cent hike in 2014 and a 10 cent hike in 2015, bringing Pennsylvania's state and federal gas tax to 76 cents a gallon, highest in the nation. Driving the turnpike also got more expensive as tolls go up 6% on January 8th, the ninth straight year of toll hikes. Also going up, those window vehicle inspection stickers, up a buck on July 1st, but those pesky little license plate stickers will disappear this year. It only eliminated the sticker. It did not eliminate the need to register your vehicle. In other words, you won't save any money, but it does cut down the hassle. There is one new law, effective January 17th, that many will like. This will be great for us and also for consumers. Beer distributors will be able to sell beer in any quantity. Six packs, four packs, singles, mixed, and growlers. Grocery stores have been doing this for five years, so they've definitely taken a lot of business away from us, and now we're definitely going to be competitive. Jamie Hively at the women owned Mellinger Beer Distributor in Oakland says distributors will be able to offer lower prices than others. Coming to distributors is always definitely cheaper, so definitely still coming here will be definitely the best place to come get your singles, four packs, and six packs, price wise. And here's another change. Bars can now sell alcohol at 9 a.m. on Sundays, and sporting venues can add mixed drinks to their menu. Bottoms up, John Delano, KDKA TV News.